Hello Gemini and welcome to your daily reading for today, Tuesday, May the 26th. It's an honour to be doing your readings. I get such amazing energy from you guys, so send you all so much love and thank you for being here. So let's see what's going on. We're going to use the Wheel of the Year Tarot today. Thank you angels. What do we need to know for Gemini please on this day? What do we need to know for Gemini? Thank you, thank you, thank you and so it is. Okay, so the first thing we've got coming up, wow, we've got the three of wands, look at that one, so powerful, this is about progress being made in your life, it's about you making decisions and doing something about them, it's about you looking at the stars and the moon and the sky and trusting that heaven is watching over you and that you are safe and that you're a very loyal person and that you deserve loyal people to be around you, so I feel your circle is increasing and there's loyalty coming in now because you're believing in who you are. You're setting boundaries. You're trusting in miracles. You're making a wish on the shooting stars and you're asking for what you want. And there's so much healing energy coming in. And this is healing energy, power, strength. Things are blooming right now. So a big sign that you're moving forward and making progress towards your dreams. We've also got the Knight of Swords. So there's fast forward motion coming in today things are moving forward things may take you by surprise so you may have some unexpected communication coming in today some unexpected news you may have some unexpected conversations but it's showing you changes things moving forward taking control and this is also you on your journey moving forward because you know that you're believing in things a lot more so you've got more time for you, more quiet time to make things happen, to put things into motion. So when I'm tuning in with this card, I'm feeling power and the power is in you. You know, you're doing reflecting, you're tuning in with heaven, you're tuning in with who you are and it's bringing in power. And we've got the nine of wands here saying to you, don't give up. But it's also about changes and boundaries and, you know, you're putting your scarecrow down there. You're creating the scarecrow to scare away anything that's, you know, getting in the way of you building your dreams. So this is about you putting boundaries down, setting things in motion, standing your ground. You know, you're not allowing anything to get in the way of your dreams right now because you know what you want and you're going for it. And the birds around there are flying around showing you changes, changes leading to freedom, leading to more power. I just feel power in this card here because you're doing what you need to do for your dreams to come true. We've got the Knight of Wands. So you've got two Knights here signifying action, things moving forward, passion and fire. So this is about making changes you've been guided to make. And it feels like you know, you've been making some changes here in your mind, you've been setting your intentions and you're now preparing for these changes and it's all coming in between now and, you know, they're giving me the autumn time because, you know, they are showing me in this card here like Halloween energy, like October time, so between now and October, accept and expect, they're saying accept and expect significant change because you're moving forward and I feel this is going to be for some of you job changes, changing homes, locations, some travel coming in because you're taking action towards your dreams and it's all happening in your mind because you're setting it out into motion, you're setting your intention, you're asking for what you want, you then believe in it's coming and it's been set into motion by the universe and your higher self. So you're asking for what you desire. You are believing with unwavering faith it's on its way. And then the changes are coming in to make it reality. Ask, believe, receive. So this is showing you everything you're dreaming of. Everything you want and it's all falling into place. And it's happening quickly. And there may be steady progress. But when it comes in it's going to happen quickly. The, the quickly, the swift action coming in you know you got two nights there that's power that's forward motion from the mind and from the heart from the passion making things happen but I feel changes so it could be a job change it could be a home change it could even be someone moving in or out and obviously with all this energy that's going on in the world I'm feeling this is about when things start moving on again 
moving forward. You're planning now for what you want to create when the new energy comes in and we can go where we want to go again and do what we want to do again. And you're setting your boundaries. You're not giving up and you're frightening off anything that's getting in the way. So this means that you're releasing yourself from fear. You're releasing yourself from the past. Anyone dragging you down, trying to knock you off the path, not believing in who you are, your goals, your dreams, or your like aspirations for your future, the things you want to create, the things you're inspired to do, you're getting rid. You know, you're scaring them off with this scarecrow. You don't want that in your life anymore. So you're scaring away things that are negative and you're attracting to you the positive. So this is really powerful. So don't give up on your dreams. Don't keep believing because it's all moving forward and it's all coming in now. Between now and October, there's huge, significant changes coming in that are going to bring in so much success into your life. But you have to do it now, believing now. And look how relaxed she is in that card there. She's just relaxing. She's looking up at the sky. She's trusting. She's believing. She knows the universe is loyal like this dog. So if you start seeing dogs, Gemini, huge sign for you that everything has fallen into place. And if you start seeing scarecrows, it's a sign to not give up and to scare off what you don't want. So you can attract what you do want. And if you've seen horses, it's a sign of moving forward. So do let me know in the comments section, whether it be today or in the coming few days, if you start seeing these signs, because I feel significantly you may see a scarecrow and you may see a dog. And that's another sign there. It's like Dorothy, in the Wizard of Oz, there was the dog Toto and the Scarecrow. And, you know, it's about you moving forward. You're on this path now to where you want to be, to the Emerald City. You're on the Yellow Brick Road. You're finding your way to the Emerald City. And that Emerald City could be a new job. It could be union with your twin flame. It could be an amazing new opportunity flowing in. It could be better health and uh, feeling energised. But whatever it is, it's coming and it's coming between now and October. It's flowing in and everything you're doing now is creating it in this moment to bring it in. You're off to the Emerald City. How amazing is that? Have a beautiful day, sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.